is Jordan Robertson with Benzinga, and joining me today is Robert Hayes, CEO and Director at Sharps Technology. Thank you so much for being here. How are you today? Hey, Jordan. Thanks for having me. Hey, Robert. Can you give us an overview of what Sharps Technology does? So thanks, Jordan, for the question. Um, Sharps Technology is a specialized drug delivery technology company that services the healthcare market, including pharmaceutical and 503B billing companies. You know, part of our strategy is to develop innovation and, and solutions for the market to better serve our customers and to help patients um, with improving their, their, their quality of life. Absolutely. And can you talk to me about how Sharp has adapted to the market over the years? Have you undergone any significant pivots or changes to your product offerings? Yeah, so that's uh, also what I would consider to be a really important part of our company being able to move from pre-revenue to revenue. So in the drug delivery space, there's many different segments to the market. Um, you can look at disposable syringes, pre-filled syringes, auto injectors, other types of technology to deliver you know, important medications to, to patients that need them. Uh, the opportunity to partner with Nephron Pharmaceuticals with their specialized pre-fillable syringe operation in Columbia, South Carolina is actually going to allow us to accelerate part of our strategy by more than two to three years. The co-manufacturing agreement we have with Nephron will allow us to bring forward a lot of our new designs to support this part of the space and then actually accelerate our revenue capabilities, you know, beginning in the later part of 23 and then going into 24. So we're really happy with our operation in Hungary, and we started that up in late uh, 22, as we announced. But the opportunity to get started to make these specialized copolymer pre-filled syringes and bring them to the market in late 23 will actually help us in, in a lot of different ways. Wonderful. And tell us about your customers. Who are they? Thanks, Jordan, for the question. So as I mentioned, our customers really are within the, the drug filling space, including what I would call branded pharma, you know, generic pharma companies, along with biologics and specialized uh, products like gene therapy. But part of our strategy also is to support Nephron through this co-manufacturing agreement, obviously the 503B space. And then as we develop solutions for them, we'll be able to take those products forward to other parts of the 503B um, industry and really help you know, drive improvements in that space with better uh, filling technology. Wonderful. And you just signed a major distribution agreement with Nephron Pharmaceuticals. What does this mean for Sharps and what's next for the company? Yeah, so the, the collaboration with Nephron is actually bigger than just the distribution and sales agreement. So in the agreement with Nephron, there's actually four parts to the, the collaboration. The first one will be the agreement, like we've talked about, to co-manufacture pre-filled syringes at their state-of-the-art manufacturing facility in Columbia, South Carolina. Uh, by doing that, you know, it pulls us forward by two to three years uh, from the standpoint of our strategy to bring these high value products forward. The part of the agreement you're mentioning is the distribution and sales agreement for our products that we produce in Europe. So there is a great opportunity for us to partner with Nephron um, to be able to sell these products. Um, ne Nephron has more than 3000 customers that they sell uh, products to today. Uh, they currently don't have a, a syringe provider um, that helps supply these types of products to their customers. So we feel that there's going to be a great opportunity to manufacture, produce, and then work with their sales team to find opportunities to bring our, our products to market. Our products are FDA approved, um, have the CE mark and are approved by the World Health Organization. So we feel like you know this will be able to fast track a lot of our sales opportunities with the products from Hungary. The other two parts of the agreement include a, a growth strategy where we can expand the copolymer syringe production capabilities with an additional 100 million units over the next few years. And then lastly, um, the pharma services program that we have agreed to build together will allow us to bring new technologies to the market to support Nephron, but also some of their customers so Sharps Technology will be the specialized healthcare packaging supplier for Nephron and their customers. So if Nephron gets a new fill finish project or program with a specialized customer, then Sharps Technology will be the packaging company to supply all that future packaging for them. Wonderful. And can you tell us what's next for Sharps Technology? 
So as, as we've already talked about the, the Nephron collaboration and the significance of that is really what we're going to focus on over the next, what I would say, you know, nine to 12 months. But part of our strategy from there is to continue to collaborate and innovate uh, for the industry. So as, as you probably already understand and the, the, the investors understand, having these relationships and collaborations within the industry are key. So including suppliers, partners, customers, and, you know, with the experience I have in the industry and the time I have in the industry, I feel like I'll be able to leverage those relationships to really move Sharps forward and, and build on those uh, partnerships that we plan to put together. And lastly, Robert, what is the most pressing issue in the American healthcare system and how do we solve it? Yeah, so I think that's, that's there, there's a lot of different ways to answer that question. Um, you know, at Sharps, you know, we, we believe in, in providing solutions for customers and healthcare providers that, that are meaningful and helpful to, to patients at the end. At the same time, trying to drive down costs for the industry, because as you read every day, you learn about how much cost is going up for healthcare products and it, the strain that it's putting on the healthcare system. So we feel by being strategic with our technology and our solutions, we can bring better products to market and provide real answers for uh, companies that need them. And also more importantly, the, the patients that use them. And so that's the example I gave to you with the, the, the disposable syringe technology that we produce in Europe. That syringe technology has ultra low waste capability. So you're not wasting drug product. It has passive and active safety to prevent you know, needle stick um, injuries, which are very costly. And then the reuse prevention, which is something that people don't think about, which by having that technology built into the syringe, you prevent, you know, further infection or misuse of that technology. So putting all of those capabilities into a single device really will help um, healthcare providers and patients that, that can use those types of uh, solutions to, to better their lives. Thank you so much for being here, Robert. Really appreciate it and hope to get to see you again. Thanks, Jordan, for your time.